Welcome to Talking Tobacco. Today we'll be discussing how to season a humidor. If your humidor is brand new or you haven't used it in a while, you'll want to season it. The first thing you should do is mount the metal plates before using any water. The reason you do that is so that they'll stick to the lid. If you do it after you wet it, the glue won't adhere properly to the lid and they'll fall off. Now is time for the water. Use only distilled water for this process as other waters will impart a taste and potential calcification. It's important to use a clean, lint-free rag for this process as well. You'll want to wipe every piece of exposed wood inside the humidor, being careful not to oversaturate. When you dampen each piece, you'll notice that it turns dark almost immediately. That's how you know that all the pieces have been dampened properly. Be sure not to over dampen anything as I've clearly done here with this tray. Be sure to also dampen all of the interior components such as tray dividers. Don't forget about the underside of the tray either. That piece is very important. Begin to dampen the main compartment of the humidor, making sure to get all of the edges and in the corners very thoroughly. It's kind of difficult, so make sure you take your time and be thorough. Once you move on to the lid, take the same care to get into the corners and all of the edges and the, the rim and the lips of the humidor itself. That'll help create a tighter seal because as the wood soaks up the moisture, they'll expand slightly, keeping the moisture inside the humidor. You'll be able to see spots that you've missed because they're a lighter color and go back later on and touch them up as necessary. Make sure not to over moisten any of the pieces because that can cause damage later on. A lot of people also forget about the exterior rim of the humidor. Make sure you get that as well. It is an important part for keeping everything moistened and humidified properly. Now it's time to prep the humidification device. You'll want a paper towel nearby in case you spill some water. I recommend doing this over a sink if you have the opportunity. Use the paper towel to blot off any excess moisture as there will be some because the device doesn't absorb it all, as you can see. This process may need to be repeated. Now it's time to mount the humidification device to the lid, put back all of the interior components such as the tray and tray dividers, and leave the lid closed for about an hour or so to let it acclimate. Repeat two more times. After the third time, refill the humidification device, mount it, and close the lid overnight. In the morning, it will be ready to go. The humidor featured in today's video is called the Ironsides. You can find it here at pipesandcigars.com.